Hey, welcome to Pretty Boy Pros. I'm your host, Brian Cooney. This week we'll be in Hawaii, Honolulu, with Sam Chandler, the owner of The Right Painter. We'll be painting some exterior stuff, some interior stuff. Please join us. Mahalo. I'm here with Sam Chandler. I've been a fan of this guy for a long time. Now I'm working with him for a couple days. Well, 10 days, right? 10 days. This guy's the best. Uh, we're becoming fast friends and uh, we played some music last night. We're downtown Honolulu. So I just learned his west. And behind us is his project. He's got the, it's a painting to do. We painted this inside there. It's a good fun thing. Hopefully done soon. <laughs> and the reason we're talking all these soffits is uh, the, the gaps actually go right into the house. So like a little power wash water would go through right into the inside of the house. Got it. And to keep uh, bugs and stuff out. Of the so these are all getting cocked. This is an amazing job. The rest of the house is already cocked. All the yeah. siding you see. Yeah. And normally we wouldn't caulk the lap siding. Um, but this is breathable with oil. Uh, you know, the oil stain on it, the oil gut. It's been up so long just to seal it was kind of what we wanted to do. Yeah. Nobody climbs a ladder like this guy. Nobody! Comfortable up there? So they're going to use a pretty boy uh, for the caulking water, which will keep the um, the caulk off their fingers. Yeah, Less we chafing. Keep, we usually keep a couple rags in the bucket and just swap, swap them out as we go, so they're not completely gummed up. Yeah. And, boom. and pretty boy thanks you. Money shot. All right, here we go. First meal here with the boys, the right painted guys. All right. What's happening? Yay! That. That's a plate lunch. <laughs> All right. Hey. Let's get that big, big blue behind you. Yeah, pretty boy in Hawaii, man. Episode number nine with Sam. Showing him this house I painted a long time ago. <laughs> Sam might be putting in a bit on this house above us, right? This is our clientele. This is beautiful. We're on the southwest side of the island. Uh, today we're going to go do the top half of some cabinets that we did. The uh, carpenter came and added on some cubbies on the top. So we did Envirolac on the bottom uh, a couple months ago. And the carpenters are done, so we're gonna go mask off the bottoms and do the top, and you're gonna see how well it blends in with this Envirolac product. So we're gonna prime today, and then caulk, and then come back tomorrow and see the top coat. all these cabinets in the barrel lack already um, with the water based stuff so we're going to prime all this raw wood today all these on the side uh, and we're just going to try to foam roll the product today and see how it works out um, we're going to pull all these front doors off or these top doors off so we can get to the bottom lip yep what are we using as a primer uh, it's in barrel lack catalyzed primer
Yeah, we did uh, we did all these walls in here, the scuffex, and all, all these ceilings. All the ceilings out there. Basically all anywhere there's ceiling in here, we did all the walls and ceilings. Up. Do -do 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 -do. The second coat. There you go. Keep it going, boys. Well, I saw a ship in the harbor. I don't know the rest of the word. I thought I'd be okay. I'd be happy up to today. Just starting painting, um, or you've been doing it for a long time. Uh, you know, use Instagram as a uh, as an encyclopedia. If you have a lot of knowledge, start making videos and sharing it with the next generation. Because there is no formal training for our our trade in the United States. Um, so just share. And, and if you are newer to painting, uh, uh, I mean, just be humble uh, with what you do. And just show, you know, you can t tell people you're a great painter till you're blue in the face, but, you know, actually show, show some videos and uh, let people discern for themselves uh, what type of education they want uh, and what they need to learn to be successful in this trade. This is your top coat of Envirolac here. Uh, in white to match the bottoms which we already did a couple of months ago I'm setting up the ED655 and it has paint thinner in it from the last material we used so I'm going to flush it and switch out the tip to a cleaner 311 HEA Titan tip with the gauge this thing has a 15 foot lead on it so we're using minimal product I'm going to pour it in here and uh, do two or three just quick mist coats with the top coat. It's a rainbow in Hawaii! Let's hear that again, Sam. One, two. It's like rain on your last Hawaii day. <laughs> we eat lunch, but we already ate. We haven't eaten. And the rain is coming down again! What are we doing, mister? We are uh, doing the solid body stain on all these deck joists. So the uh, deck guys can finish this weekend and uh, can have his deck back by Monday. Hi Jason, you've been working with Sam for how long? Uh, I've been working with him for about a half a year now. Started in June of this last year. I'm on the apprentice in the, in the group. I've been learning the ropes. Yeah. How do you like it so far? Oh, it's been good so far, you know, learning a, learning a new trade, learning another part of life. It's been good. You can't beat it, I mean, 
in Hawaii, right? <laughs> Painting, and this is my office today. I mean, look at this. It's beautiful. <laughs> a little hot, but you know, a little sweat never killed anybody. was um, the right painter, the name, the right painter. Yes. I, I think I know what it means, but you know, what do you think it means? Or what, you know what it means. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think, I think, a, let's just turn that around. Here's, here's the good story on it. Um, I was painting for some people that I, you know, I grew up with here, they're builders now, and they, everybody kept saying, we had the wrong painter last time, and I would say, you have the right painter this time. But here's the other story. I was on Thumbtack when I moved back here, and I was, creating leads with that. I don't use it anymore. I used it until I didn't need it anymore. And it said, help so-and-so find the right painter. So I thought it'd be clever to say the right painter. So when they were scanning through all the painting companies, it would say the right painter. So that's the two uh, two versions of how it came about. And it's a great name. I'm very proud of it. Very proud of my company, my crew. Uh, we've worked really hard over the years to get where we're at. Well, we did all this section already. Uh, we brushed and rolled all this, and so we figured it was stuck with patch. Yeah, they'll right get that fixed, going, yeah. So we got to touch that up, and we're going to spray and back roll this wall uh, with Sherwin Williams Duration Satin, like the same color as the house. We do this little wall here, this one, and yep. this, this side. Yep. And we, um, nice. And that's all we have left. And then JT, how long have you been working with Sam and the right painter? Uh, about two years, just about, I would say, give or take. Okay, cool. Enjoying it? Yeah, it's cool, you know, learning something new, working with longtime bros. It's a good deal. That's nice. You like the interior stuff, exterior, doesn't matter? Uh, I like both. Anything that's usually ground floor. Once it gets up two, three stories, then you know, <laughs> doesn't matter if it's inside or outside. <laughs> Let the young guys do that one, right? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Cheers. Thank you, sir. This is Luke, uh, Sam's right hand man. Uh, so, when did when did you get into painting? Uh, it was about seven, eight years ago. Pretty much I was starting a family and you know needed something more steady than just the music so wound up uh, meeting Sam at a bar at a show and uh, he needed some work or needed some help for some work and uh, I needed some work that was steady and you know decent pay so it worked out really well I was able to learn in the field and get paid with Sam and you know it led to continuing to do this this work regardless you know so it's become a part of my life for sure. It's a nice way to spend a day if you have to make some money, right? Yeah, for sure. You know, you're outside, you know, a lot of the time. I mean, sometimes you're doing exteriors, but the job's always different. But, you know, I work with my hands a lot doing the drumming, and so the painting is kind of a natural evolution, too, from that. It's staying physical, you know, and 
helps keep you young and uh, agile, I guess. Fantastic. Yeah, I just saw Luke play it. What was the name of the band? Kolohe Kai. Oh, these guys are big time. So I saw them play at the uh, at Blue, Blue Note. Note. Yep. Downtown in Honolulu. So, well, thanks for your time, my friend. It's been a pleasure working with you for this last week. And yeah, you bet. It's I'll... been great hanging out with you. And I appreciate you coming to the show and doing all this stuff to help us out with these products, man. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in it to win it. Yeah. <laughs> Peace. Peace. All right. So, Mr. Wright Painter, Sam Chandler, you got your first nice mobile. And all the hard paint work has paid off. You got yourself a nice, what do you call it? A, a bid mobile. Uh, bid mobile. Yeah, the truck seats are a little tight for my six foot two, so this was uh, a little more nice to cruise around the island in. I spend most of my days driving from job to job now and delivering paint, so this is perfect. You feel like the bids have gone up a little bit and now you got a Porsche? Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, if you have any um, old paint memorabilia from paint stores, uh, etc., just like uh, old brushes, things like that, you want to share online, because uh, I have a large collection myself. Um, uh, antique, it's hashtag antiquepaintingshit.com. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll uh, make sure I have yeah, that underneath. Put it He'll put it right, <laughs> right here. Yeah, right. <laughs> but yeah, just, just use that hashtag. It's different on Facebook and Instagram. Uh, but yeah, share your stuff. Cause start watching around the world. You know, it's not just the United States. Open your horizons and see what the rest of the world is doing. Painters in Africa, man, they do some uh, amazing work as well. It's just, it's a, there's a huge world of painting out there. I implore you to uh, to take a look at it, investigate, enjoy it, because uh, that's what you chose to do for a living. Brand. So thank you so much, my friend. Yeah, it's man. been wonderful. Love it. And uh, he's episode nine, Pretty Boy Pros. <laughs> episode nine, Sam Chandler, the right painter. And by the way, please subscribe. That's right. I'll clean the insides out. Yes. Peace. Not. Oh, mahalo. <laughs> yeah. Aloha, mahalo, Aloha, mahalo, mahalo, Brian, for being such a uh, great guest and coming all the way out here uh, to Hawaii. I know it's a tough, tough transition from New York City. He said he wanted to make the top ten. He's in there in the, at the buzzer at nine. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> all right. It. All right. Please subscribe. Take care. All right, sets it up. <laughs> All right, we're having a little pretty boy cleaning party. Luke, Jason, and JT. <laughs> there you go, man. That's it. This is great.